The Perfect High by Shel Silverstein. There once was a boy named Gimme Some Roy. He was nothing like me or you. Cause laying back and getting high was all he cared to do. As a kid, he sat in a cellar sniffing airplane glue. And then he smoked bananas, which was then the thing to do. He tried aspirin and Coca-Cola, breathed helium on the sly. And his life was just one endless search to find that perfect high. But grass just made him want to lay back and eat chocolate chip pizza all night. And great things he wrote while he was stoned looked like shit in the morning light. And speed just made him rap all day. Reds just laid him back. And cocaine rose was sweet to the nose, but the price nearly broke his back. He tried PCP and THC, but they didn't quite do the trick. And poppers nearly blew his heart and mushrooms made him sick. Acid made him see the light, but he couldn't remember it long. And hashish was just a little too weak and smack a lot too strong. And quaaludes made him stumble, booze just made him cry. Till he heard of a cat named Baba Fats, who knew of the perfect high. Now Baba Fats was a hermit cat who lived up in Nepal, high on a craggy mountaintop up a sheer and icy wall. But Hell said, Roy, I'm a healthy boy. I'll crawl or climb or fly. But I'll find that guru who give me the clue as to what's the perfect high. So out and off goes give me some Roy to a land that knows no time. Up a trail no man could conquer to a cliff no man could climb. For 14 years he tries that cliff and back down again he slides. He sits and cries and climbs again pursuing the perfect high. He's grinding his teeth, coughing blood. He's aching and shaking and weak. And starving and sore and bleeding and tore, he reaches the mountain peak. And his eyes blink red like a snow-blind wolf, and he snarls the snarl of a rat. And there in perfect repose and wearing no clothes sits the godlike Baba Fats. What's happening, Fats, says Roy with joy. I've come to state my biz. I hear you're hip to the perfect trip. Please tell me what it is. For you can see, says Roy to he, that I'm about to die. So for my last ride, Fats, how can I achieve the perfect high? Well, dog my cats, said Baba Fats. Here's one more burnt out soul. Who's looking for some alchemist to turn his trip to gold? But you won't find it in no dealer's stash or no druggist's shelf. Son, if you want the perfect high, you'll find it in yourself. Why, you jive motherfucker, screamed Gimme Some Roy. I've climbed through rain and sleet. I've lost three fingers off my hand and four toes off my feet. I've braved the lair of the polar bear and tasted maggot's kiss. Now you tell me the highs in myself. What kind of shit is this? My ears, for they froze off, says Roy, had heard all kinds of crap. But I didn't climb no 14 years to listen to some sophomore rap. And I didn't crawl up here to hear that high is on the natch. So you tell me where the real stuff is, or I'll kick your guru ass. Okay, okay, says Boba Fats. You're forcing it out of me. There's a land beyond the sun that's known as Zabali. A wretched land of stone and sand where snakes and buzzards scream. In the devil's garden blooms the mystic Zuzu tree. In every ten years it blooms one flower as white as the Key West sky. And he who eats of the Zuzu flower will know the perfect high. For the rush comes on like a tidal wave and it hits like the blazing sun. And high it lasts a lifetime and the down don't never come. But the Zaboli land is ruled by a giant who stands 12 cubits high. With eyes of red, a hundred heads, he waits for the passerby. And you must slay the red-eyed giant and swim the river of slime, where the mucus beasts they wait to feast on those who journey by. And if you survive the giant and the beast that swim that slimy sea, there's a blood-drinking witch who sharpens her teeth as she guards the Zuzu tree. To hell with your witches and giants, laughs Roy. To hell with your beast of the sea. As long as the Zuzu flower blooms, some hope still blooms for me. And with tears of joy in a snow-blind eye, Roy hands the guru a five. Then back down the icy mountain he crawls, pursuing the perfect high. Well, that's that, said Boba Fats, sitting back down on his stone, facing another thousand years of talking to God alone. It seems, Lord, says Fats, it's always the same, old men or bright-eyed youth. It's always easier to sell them some shit than it is to give them the truth. <laughs>